My name is Dana Draper. I'm a figurative artist and I've been working with copper for the last uh, eight years. I, I work with professional models and uh, I think one of the reasons is uh, I think the, the female figure is, is tremendously beautiful and wonderful and uh, represents the optimism of the future. Um, and for me it's a visual delight. So. Uh, I like the feelings of motion and try to capture that. Uh, I've been working with copper where I use acids and oxides to get natural colors uh, and then I might go into the copper with abrasives to bring out the luster of the copper. Um, and I, I, How did you get started with this process? Uh, with, with this particular process I uh, it was an accident. I had uh, a piece of copper lying around and uh, I, I just put some uh, rice vinegar on it. And, uh, oh, some blues came out. And, and then from there I, I experimented with other uh, things like salt, rock salt. Uh, there's any number of things you can use. Even rainwater will have a particular, uh, you know, uh, acidic compo uh, composition. So um, from there I just progressed and developed and, and uh, been doing this myself. I've been a figurative artist for 35 years so um, most of my work probably uh, goes into more into the more uh, um, what, uh, intimate areas of a house, uh, bedroom areas, uh, changing of uh, dressing areas, uh, bath areas, spas, um, and uh, let's see what else. Uh, what was the inspiration for this piece here? Yeah, uh, this piece. Well, it was a, a yoga, a yoga pose, really, a, the awkward pose. And I don't know if you can spin all the way around to the one on your all the way hard left. That piece, this piece over here. Th this piece is, is more of a, uh, a a creation myth where uh, uh, I, I, I in fact call it Eve's wish, and uh, th this was when my son and daughter-in-law were in, in the process of uh, becoming parents, and uh, so that was my inspiration. Um, th these two pieces over here, I have. Uh, it, I call it Mondrian's fantasies, and Mondrian uh, did a lot of geometric paintings uh, where he was interested primarily in the vertical and the horizontal, and uh, and so in that sense, I mean, we, we have horizontal figures, vertical figures, and and uh, the activity of being vertical as opposed to you know what, the relaxation, the reposing uh, of the horizontal. Um, but that can progress all the way to uh, the end of our lives and, and death and you know the final repose. Um, and you want to end with the optimistic one? <laughs> <laughs> well, I, th I think just going back again to, to, to oh, I guess symbolically, I mean, or, or maybe in reality, uh, the woman is, is the creator. Um, she needs the help of men, but, but uh, is the creator and, and is the optimism of the future.